does his work. Will I be purchasing this again? Used every single drop of it. I have not finished just one, but two, three, and four. Hello, Annyeong. This is Yuhi from One Eye Beauty, the place to find out all the Korean beauty info in one eye. It has been nearly a year since running this channel, and today is my first empties video. Yay! I've been preparing for this video for a long period of time, trying to keep these bottles well away from my boys so that they don't turn into some sort of a toy craft weapon, yeah, or whatever. <laughs> I've managed to gather a lot and now it's the time to share with you my honest thoughts on these products. So without further ado, let's get this going. Before we kickstart, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button to show you some love and support. 감사합니다. Thank you so much. <laughs> I'll go through these empties by the order of the skincare routine. So let's start with the cleansing products. So the first empty product is Beauty of Joseon Ginseng Cleansing Oil. You guys must be so tired of me talking about this. Now I have done a full video on this comparing with other best-selling Western and Japanese brand cleansing oils. Plus it has been featured in my 12 Beauty of Joseon product review videos. So if you want to find more about this, I suggest you to go and check out those videos. I won't go too much about this in this video because I've mentioned it too many times, yeah? It is a really good lightweight ginseng cleansing oil with 50% of soybean oil and 0.1% ginseng seed oil. Ginseng has multiple benefits and it's antioxidant, it boosts hydration, reduces fine lines and wrinkles, the list goes on. Personally, I like the smell of this product as well. It's got a pleasantly subtle smell of ginseng, but I have noticed some Western reviewers saying that they did not like the smell. I'm very sensitive when it comes to smell and fragrance in a product as well. I did not mind it, but I thought I'd just let you guys know. I think the one major flaw of this product is that it doesn't remove stubborn waterproof eye makeup very well. But because it's so nourishing and soothing, it kind of makes up for it, yeah? So will I be buying this product again? Yes, absolutely. This is a very soothing and nourishing cleansing oil. I totally buy this again. Next, Corserex Advanced Radiance Snail Dual Essence. This contains the Corserex's famous Advanced Snail 96 Mousse and Power Essence along with Niacinamide. It's separated into two, the Snail Mousse on one side and Nice and nice on the other. As you can see, it's not really completely empty, but I'll explain to you about that later on. This is slightly more expensive than the Snail Mousse in essence because it's got niacinamide as well, but I think it's worth buying this one. If you like niacinamide like myself and like Snail Mousse in essence, this is definitely worth going for. I also like its packaging as it's like a pump out style rather than like a drop on because it will prevent it from being oxidized but as you can see you might be left with a bit more snail mousse in and compared to niacinamide as you can see niacinamide it has is pretty much empty and i'm left with a bit more snail mousse in. so that is the only flaw of this packaging so will i be purchasing this product again well, I've been reaching out to snail products to hydrate my skin, but now I've moved towards to propolis and hyaluronic acid to hydrate my dry skin. But I do really like niacinamide still. So if you like niacinamide like myself and enjoy snail mousse and essence, then I'd highly recommend this product. Even though you might end up getting a bit more snail mousse inside left, I think it's still worth it. Now let's move on to the serums. I have a fair bit of serums to show you and the first one is this one over here from X's Y Dark Spot Correcting Glow Serum. Once in a while this used to be everywhere on social media. Does it work? Does it not work? Not work? No. There was a major debate on this product. Well this contains three key ingredients to control skin brightening, melanin and dark spots. Those are adenosine, niacinamide and rice bran extract. All of these ingredients are superb ingredients for skin brightening. And the important question is, does this work? In my opinion, there is no such serums that will completely remove your dark spots. However though, this does help to even out your skin tone, you know, your darker patches here and there. This will definitely help to even those out. 
So even though I still have my major dark spots here and there, this definitely gave me more confidence towards my skin without makeup. So I say this works, it just takes some time. By the time you finish the bottle, you will notice the difference. So yeah, I reckon this works. So will I be purchasing this again? Yes. Yes, absolutely. I'll be buying this again. My mom spotted the difference. She's very honest with me. She was when she saw my nude skin without anything on it, no makeup. She was like, "What's happened to your skin? Have you got something on? Like, have you changed your foundation?" I was like, "No, this is my bare skin." Yeah, and she was really surprised. Yeah, so even my very honest mom, yeah, she agreed that this has made difference to my skin. So yeah, this one works, guys. Moving on to two vitamin C serums now. First one is Sun By Me Galactomyces Pure Vitamin C Glow Serum. This contains 75% of Galactomyces and 30,000 ppm of vitamin C as well as niacinamide and adonisin. This is really soothing and gentle vitamin C serum so I'd recommend this for vitamin C starters or those with a sensitive skin. I really enjoyed using this. It's it's brilliant. It's effective and very gentle. So will I be purchasing this again? Yes, absolutely. I'd love to add this back into my morning skincare routine. I've got another vitamin C serum I want to show you from Goodle. Green Tangerine Vita C Dark Spot Care Serum. I featured this serum in my Nelly Empty Bottle Shorts video. But after finishing it, I threw out the bottle. Can you believe? I'm sorry guys, I have no idea how I threw that out. Actually, I can't remember throwing it out. Maybe my voice took it. I do not know, yeah? But it's not with me. I apologize for that, but I did use it and really enjoyed using this vitamin C serum. This is a viral vitamin C serum as they have sold over 4 million bottles. It contains 70% of Jeju green tangerine extract vitamin C and niacinamide. And they claim that say goodbye to dark spots after two weeks. Hmm, I think that's a bit overstated, yeah? As I've told you previously, I don't think there are any dark spot serums that really completely clears your dark spots, but this is very effective too. It, it did help to even up the skin tone and maintain my skin looking healthy. So will I be purchasing this one again? Yes, absolutely. But just one thing is that this is a bit stronger than the previous Sun By Me serum. So I, for those of you with sensitive skin, just be aware that this vitamin C serum can be a bit strong. Next I have is the anti-aging serum from Modest, Metrosil 10% worth hyaluronic acid. Metrosil is a high strength peptide composition that's developed in France. It's a great retinol alternative ingredient for those of you who find retinol too harsh on their skin. So the major purpose of the serum will be anti-aging. It's very hydrating, soothing and gentle on the skin. So nothing's wrong with the serum. I think it's great. Will I be purchasing this again? You would think that my answer would be yes, but I have found another serum from The Ordinary that is almost identical to this serum at half the price. This also contains Metrosol 10% with hyaluronic acid, so I've now switched to this serum, yeah? They seriously feel almost exactly the same. Now moving on to an anti-aging ampule from Innisfree here. Retinal Cica Repair Ampule. This is a really good ampule for the retinal starters as it contains very little amount of retinol, 0.015% and it also contains Cica so it keeps the hydration level really well because retinol can dehydrate your skin a bit but this contains Cica so I didn't notice that, that particular dryness on my skin. So it's a great retinol ampule. Will I be purchasing this again? Probably not though, only because I've now moved upper level in my retinol strength. I now use up to 0.5%, so introducing to another serum by The Ordinary. Now I've moved on to retinol 0.5% and this contains squalene as well, so I use this as my retinol serum in my nighttime routine. But for those of you who have really sensitive skin or wants to start retinol, then I'd suggest this ampule, definitely. 
Oof, I still have a lot to go through, so let's get this going fast. Moving on to the cream now. The first one I have is this one over here from Toradin Dive In Soothing Cream. I have done a shorts video on this. It's a really soothing and hydrating cream that's ranked as number one in the Hua Hair app, Korea's most trusted beauty app. I thought this is really ideal in summer, especially as it has a cooling effect to it. This contains five types of hyaluronic acid in different molecular sizes to help with absorption and provide intense moisture. So will I be purchasing this product again? Yes, in summertime. This is a super hydrating product that will help to cool down any redness. My next empty product is this one over here, Beauty of Joseon Dynacity Cream. You guys must be really tired of me talking about this as well as I've read about this product too many times now. I have done a short video on this product myself opening my third tub of this and also featured in my 12 of Beauty of Joseon product review video. This is a really elegant and well formulated cream enriched with nourishing hanbang skincare ingredients with 5% ginseng root extract, 2% niacinamide, 29% rice bran water and 2% squalane. How can you not love this product? This product is such a well balanced divine cream that feels luxurious but inexpensive. Will I be buying this product again? What do you think I'll say? <laughs> yes, absolutely. I'm gonna buy this like fourth top, fifth top, sixth top. Yes, yes, yes. Moving on to the eye patches now. The one I really enjoy using is this one over here. Corsrex Advanced Snail Hydrogel Eye Patch. I love eye patches in general and this one is probably the best one I've used so far. I have done a long form video covering this eye patch along with one other eye patch from Hamish. Unlike other eye patch that commonly contains one pair of two patches, this contains one other part, so it contains a total of three patches. I usually like to use that one extra patch on my between eyebrows. You know the famous Corsarex Advanced Nail 96 Mousse and Power Essence? This is basically infused with the essence that helps to hydrate and plump your eye area, and it also contains niacinamide to help brighten your under eyes. So will I be purchasing this again? Yes, absolutely yes. See, you guys, I do not hate Corsarex, yeah? <laughs> I have previously done a shorts video saying that I did not enjoy their all-in-one cream and have received so many criticisms and haters through that shorts video. Guys, I like to clarify that I do not hate any specific brands. I just like to be really honest with my product reviews, yeah? So don't hate me too much. Next, moving on to the sun care products. The one I really enjoy using is this one from Isn't Tree Watery Sun Gel SP50 Plus PA4 Pluses. This is an extremely hydrating sunscreen with eight types of hyaluronic acid. And as you can see, that I have used every single drop of it, yeah? I cut it into halves and scraped off pretty much all of it. I really enjoy using this especially because I have a dry skin. This is very hydrating with a dewy finish and no white cast. So will I be purchasing the sun gel again? The answer to that will be yes and no at the same time. You might be surprised to hear this as I've been like raving about this all along. This is a great product, so I will definitely be purchasing again as my dry skin loved it. However though, I will say no at the same time because I have found a better Korean sunscreen, can you believe? Korean sunscreens have evolved a lot and my current number one that beats this one now is this one over here from Number Sun, Number One Clear Filter Sun Essence. I find this much more hydrating than this one. I won't go too much about this sunscreen now because I have covered this sunscreen from my previous video. If you're interested in finding out, I suggest you go and check out that video. This was a sponsored product and a sponsored video. However, though, I keep going back to this because it's so good, yeah? I keep repurchasing it, yeah? This is so hydrating and on my dry skin, it's also suitable for oily skin type as well because it's non comedogenic so as I mentioned I wouldn't go too much on it. It's a great product. Go and check out the video if you're interested. But this product from Isn't Tree is also still superb. Yeah, I still love your brand Isn't Tree and I love this product. So I'd still recommend this sun gel. Yes. 
Finally, we have come to the very last empty product and it's this one over here, Hera Sunmate. I have not finished just one tube of this, but two, three, and four, can you believe, yeah? Hera is one of the top mainstream Korean beauty brands that belong to America Pacific, Korea's largest cosmetics company. And its brand ambassador is Jenny from Blackpink. As you can see here, this has been my long time favorite Korean sunscreen and to the entire nation in Korea, as this used to be called Korea's national sunscreen. So this is a really popular classic Korean sunscreen that has been reformulated many times over the years for more than past over a decade. The formulation I have with me is the older formulation. I've happened to keep all these tubes for some reason. <laughs> Their latest reform version is this one over here, Hera Sunmate Laports, and this has been ranked as number two in Glowpick Best Sun Care Awards. This is a strong waterproof protection with sweatproof film technology. It contains skin soothing properties such as witch hazel leaf water that keeps the skin feeling comfortable and hydrated during long outdoor activities. It absorbs quickly and has a radiantly matte finish without any white cast. At One Eye Beauty website, we have a mini shop and we are selling this product right now on sale up to 40% off. So go and check it out if you're interested. I will leave the link down in the information section below. So will I be purchasing this product again? Yes, absolutely. I'm not just saying this because we are selling it. I'm only selling this because I absolutely approve this product. It has been my long time favorite sun care product that I will use whenever I'm exposed to water or sweat. It is my absolute favorite ongoing purchase. So yes, I definitely would be purchasing this again, again, and again. Woo! That's it guys. Thank you so much for following me this long. If you're interested in shopping for any of the products I mentioned in today's video, all the shopping links will be down in the information section below. So go and check them out. And please leave a comment if you tried out any of these products, if you're interested in any of them. I'd love to hear from you all. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next Korean beauty video. Annyeong! Thank you.